Fighting from the pandemic is the scientific advancements in making vaccines. Now companies are applying it to flu shots, which they could save thousands of lives. WMRT News' Abby Isaacs explains. This could be another real game changer. Despite the availability of vaccines, hundreds of thousands of people die from the flu worldwide every year. But COVID-19 accelerated advancements with mRNA technology used by Pfizer and Moderna that scientists believe will improve their efficacy. Hopefully save lots and lots of lives. Pharmaceutical companies have faced long-standing challenges with developing flu shots. Dr. Christopher Thompson says they take about six months to make and they're normally 20 to 40 percent effective. We're watching what happens in the southern hemisphere, trying to predict what's going to happen during our flu season up here. The virus may mutate during production of the vaccine and we can't do anything about it. This process has been used for more than 70 years and uses a weakened or inactive germ to trigger an immune response. mRNA vaccines instead teach our cells how to make a protein that then triggers an immune response and they can be manufactured much more quickly. We can wait a little bit longer to try and have a better prediction of what the virus is going to look like. This week, Moderna announced the beginning of another trial for seasonal flu vaccines using mRNA technology. The company is also prepping its first candidate for phase three trials, and they have others in development that offer a combination of protections. There's a hope that we can give you one vaccine every fall that has stuff for flu, has stuff for COVID, has stuff for RSV, and you feel crummy for a couple of days as you react to that vaccine, and then you're protected from all of them for the next year. Dr. Thompson predicts we're still a year or two away from FDA approval. In Baltimore, Abby Isaacs, WMAR2 News.